We are just 10 days away from the country's top dogs showing off their stuff at the 145th Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show. But the pandemic means a few changes. Our Marissa Alter sat down with the show's resident expert who lives in Darien. <laughs> Gail Miller Beicher may temporarily have her hands full with Simon and Bella, but Beicher more than knows her way around the dog show ring. I am considered the voice and the face of Westminster. Beicher is the communications director for the Westminster Kennel Club, as well as an on-air analyst for its iconic dog show, typically a winter event held at Madison Square Garden. It's the first year that it's not happening in Manhattan. So it really is historic, and of course that's due to the pandemic. The nation's top dogs will spend a weekend in the country at Lindhurst Mansion in Terrytown, New York. The expansive grounds will host more than 2,500, including 200 breeds, all competing for the title of Best in Show. Lindhurst has a history hosting dog shows and a past connection to Westminster. The Gould family, who lived at Lynnhurst, Jay Gould's family, actually showed dogs in the late 1800s, early 1900s at Westminster. And in fact, one of his sons judged at Westminster. Also different this year, the dogs won't have their pack of fans in person. There's no spectators for safety reasons, but Beicher says coverage is expanded with every event and round aired or live streamed. One of my favorite parts of the show is really just celebrating dogs and thinking about the history that in 1877 at the very first Westminster Kennel Club dog show, people were doing the exact same thing we're going to be doing in a few weeks, which is celebrating dogs and our love of dogs. In Darianne, Marissa Alter, News 12, Connecticut. Westminster weekend takes place June the 11th through the 13th. We have a link to the full schedule and where you can watch on our website and the News 12 app. You can also find more statistics about this year's show, including how many dogs are from Connecticut.